Hi, I'm Dr. Ashujit Kaur Anand. I'm the director of Aveksha, which is a home-based primary care services at PCMH Restore Health, Bangalore. My expertise is in palliative medicine and geriatric medicine. So we reach out to people at their home who are unable to avail services at a clinic or a hospital. So a cholera, as it is because of water contamination, it is mainly what we call the fecal-oral contamination. So the water gets contaminated by the fecal matter. So it is because of improper sanitation, like uh, it's mostly seen among rural areas or urban slums where there's no proper sanitation and people defecate in the open, which can contaminate the source of water, the drinking water. And that's when people get infected or affected by the cholera. And the best way of preventing is that what is called wash, W-A-S-H, and where you have the water, clean drinking water, washing your hands, sanitation, maintaining sanitary, uh, that is not defecating in the open air, and hygiene. By hygiene is washing your hands properly for 20 seconds with soap and water before eating your food or after using the toilet. So these are the preventive measures. So drinking safe water is that you have clean water to drink by boiling the water. That's the best method. Otherwise, you have the filter at home, which is the reverse osmosis, the RO filter, which everybody has, most of the houses have. Those who do not have can use the boiled water to drink. Eat healthy food, avoid street food because that can be contaminated because the person who again is making the food could be contaminated from his hand the cholera which gets transmitted to the food and then to us so the best way is to avoid street food eat hot freshly cooked food that's the best way to prevent cholera and the treatment of course the first step to treatment because it's mainly the diarrhea that is the loose motions that a person gets so there are chances of getting dehydrated you need to drink a lot of water just plain water or it can be coconut water or it can be the oral rehydration solution which can be made at home a lemon juice with a pinch of salt can be helpful or the ORS packet which is available in the medical store can be taken and taken uh, orally or it is that you be also have antibiotics for treatment of cholera for which please speak to your family physician if you suspect that you have diarrhea which is not getting better and if you think you have cholera speak to your family physician and ask for the further treatment.